Today I'm going to show you how I create a Nearpod lesson to help me with attendance and lunch count. I'm going to name my lesson. I'm going to add a slide. First I'm going to put a cover slide. I'm going to pick a theme so that there's color in the background. And tell my students good morning. I'm going to pick a picture so that there's something pretty to look at. I can pick a picture that I have on file or I can come and search. I'm going to search smiling children because we are all happy to be at school today. I'm going to save and exit this slide. I'm going to save the theme change that I made. Students need to sign in to a lesson. So that takes care of the attendance part. Um, they're going to join the lesson using their name. So I'm going to add a slide for lunch count. Um, for that, I'm going to go to add activity and I'm going to select poll. Um, for today's purposes, I'm gonna make this poll more generic. If I wanted to, I could edit this activity every day to reflect the lunch choices of the day, but then I would need to generate a new code every day. Um, with more generic choice one, choice two, then I can use the lesson code for the life of, life of the lesson code and only have to generate a code about once every month. So I'm going to say choose your lunch. I'm going to type in choice one, choice two. I'm going to add an answer and add packed lunch. I'm going to come down here. I'm gonna turn this off so that students can only select one choice. I, I don't want them to select more than one lunch choice. I'm gonna save my poll and I'm done.